sonograph was invented around 1820 by Nicolas Riosec. The basic idea behind the chronograph is to calculate an interval of time. It can be used in various domains, but the first use was in fact to time a horse race. Early chronographs deposited a tiny drop of ink to show a given interval between two fixed points, hence the graph. The first improvement was to do away with the ink and show a lapsed time on counters, 20 minutes, an hour, or 30 minutes. The problem with the first chronographs was that they immobilized the movement. The solution to this was to build a complication by adding an additional module on top of the base module. It's important for a good quality chronograph to have a column wheel. This column wheel is the heart of the chronograph mechanism. It governs some very important parts that start, stop or reset the chronograph hand. This is when the watchmaker has to take care that the lift and fall functions are perfectly adjusted. It's really very hard to position the components, screw them into place, and for the chronograph to be adjusted exactly as it should be. We always have some fine tuning to do, however minimal. It's the only way to ensure the chronograph will function perfectly. The areas in which the chronograph can be used are really vast. For example, we can use a graduated dial to calculate a pulse by starting the chronograph at the start of a pulsation. A scale around the edge of the dial shows the number of pulsations in real time. A more interesting example is to time sporting events at the Olympic Games, say or a car race by calculating the distance between competitors. The chronograph has inspired the watch industry from the turn of the century to the present day. Every company has made chronographs at some point and some still perpetuate this tradition in the spirit of 50 or 60 years ago.